Hello guys, in this video tutorial we will show you how the point of sales host system works on the mobile device for the payment collector. Open the payment collector app which is the delivery boy app for now. Log into your app account with the credentials provided by the admin. Just to inform you the payment collectors won't be able to sign up through the app and can be added only by the admin. Once you have logged in, you will be redirected to the Payment Collector dashboard. On the dashboard, you can view stats and post figures. Here you can check pending payments, pending deliveries, and the daily, weekly, and monthly collection generated using the post's payment. On the dashboard, you can also manage readers. You can view the reader details and reader status, connected or disconnected. If you want, you can also pair new readers by tapping on the Pair New Reader button. Now tap the Assign menu icon and then tap the Store Pickup option. Here you can check the orders with the pending and completed payments. You can also search and filter the orders. Now tap the Collect Payment button and you will be redirected to the Payment Details page. Here you can check the amount to be collected and also check whether the reader is connected to the mobile device or not. Just to inform you, the reader is connected to the mobile device via Bluetooth and for now, we currently accommodate payment from the BB Post Chipper 2X BT card reader only. You can use the reader to accept credit and debit card payments at the point of payment. If the reader is not connected to the mobile device, then you need to connect the reader before collecting the payment. Please note that the reader must be connected through the app only and not through the native mobile Bluetooth settings. Tap the Connect Reader button to search for the readers. Once the reader's search is completed, tap connect to connect the reader to the mobile device. Once the reader is connected, you can process the payment. If you want, you can also manage readers from here. Next, tap the process payment button. You'll be redirected to the card reader screen. Now you can accept credit and debit card payments by inserting, inserting or swiping cards on the card reader. Once done, remove the credit or debit card from the reader. Finally, you will be redirected to the payment confirmation screen. Here you can view the transaction ID, order ID, and the amount collected using the post payment option. Now tap the go home button to go back to the payment collector dashboard. That's all for now. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get the latest updates as soon as they are live.